Ladies and gentlemen, welcome back to another video. In today's video, I will be creating a quick tutorial on how to install Minecraft Pixelmon 9.1.0, so you guys can play along with me whenever I'm playing on any Pixelmon servers. So, let's jump into it. In order to get any mods onto Minecraft, you will need what's called Forge. For this instance, Pixelmon 9.1.0 is on Minecraft 1.16.5. Oh, and just before I forget, just to help you guys out with all of the websites that I use in this video, they will be linked in the description. So if you need them quickly, you can just head on down there and click the links. I'm also using Google Chrome for this, so I'd advise that you guys do the same, just in case there's any issues, I'll be able to help you with them in the comments down below. Anyways, so what you guys will need to do is navigate over to the 1.16.5 Forge. Then you want to download the recommended version. This one is always tend to be the best. Sometimes there are better ones with the download latest, but they're not as reliable. So I'd always make sure that you go with download recommended. After you've done that, you just want to hit install. When you get to this page, you do not want to click anything. There might be some ads that will pop up right here. Do not click them as you might get a virus. And I'm warning you now, don't click them. Eventually in the top right, you'll see a button that says skip. What I want you to do is just click skip. After you do that, as you can see down the bottom, it will then download Forge 1.16.5. What you want to do then is just click it and it will open up. Once your Forge installer has popped up, all you want to do is just not touch anything else other than just click OK. Make sure that it's in the right area as well, but once you've done that, all you've got to do is simply click OK. Then it will install the Forge and eventually once it's finished, you'll be all ready to go. Then all you do is click OK, and now Forge has been installed onto your computer in the .minecraft section. Next, what I want you guys to do is navigate over to the Pixelmon website. I've got it linked in the description like I said before, so it'll be easy for you guys to find it. Once you get onto this page, there's two different download links. There's the 1.12.2 and the 1.16.5. But for this video, all we want to be concerned by is the download 1.16.5. As you can see, we've already installed Forge, so this isn't an issue. All you want to do is just click download 1.16.5. Once you do this again, make sure that you do not click any buttons that pop up. There might be a button that comes up saying allow, don't click that. Don't click anything else on this page other than the skip button, just so you make sure that you don't get any viruses. Once you click skip, like before, it will start installing Pixelmon 1.16.5. So now that your Pixelmon has installed, all you want to do now is navigate over to the downloads file. As you can see, Pixelmon is already in here, and that's all that matters for now. So now that you've located your Pixelmon file in the downloads, you don't need the internet anymore, so you can close that off. Next, what you want to do is open up your Minecraft launcher. Once you've got Minecraft open, all you want to do is head over to Installations. Once you've headed into there, click New Installation. Once you're in there, you want to just name this whatever you want to name it. So for this, I'm just going to name it Pixelmon Tutorial. Once you've done that, then you want to go onto the version. For this, all you want to do is find your Pixelmon 1.16.5 Forge. So as you can see, I've got it right here. All you want to do now is just click on that. Now, once you've clicked on your Forge version, what you want to do is head down to more options. If you've got a strong enough PC, I would strongly advise doing this. With the number two down here, what you want to do is just switch it out for something like a four or a five. Basically, what this does is it dedicates more RAM to Minecraft so that when you're playing, it will have a much smoother FPS and you'll be able to run the game a lot better. Now, once you've done all of this, all you've got to do is just click create. Once you've done that, as you can see, my forge will be somewhere in here. Pixelmon tutorial. Perfect. Just here at the bottom. So once you've located your Pixelmon save, all you want to do now is open up the folder. Once you click that, you'll be in Minecraft. If you don't want to do it this way, you can also do it by entering the start bar and typing in percent app data percent, and it'll open you up to the exact same place. All you've got to do then is just open up dot Minecraft. Once you've done that, you want to then right click, click new, make a new folder and call it mods. No uppercases, just mods. Once you've done that, then you want to just open up that folder and then locate your downloads folder again. All you've got to do from here is just drag Pixelmon into the mods folder. And that is literally it. Once you do that, you then want to go back onto Minecraft and click play. So once your Minecraft launcher has finally loaded up, you'll know that you've done it correctly. As for me, it says Pixelmon right here. 
You can also go into mods and you can check to see if the Pixelmon mod has successfully downloaded. And as you can see here, I have the Pixelmon mod, meaning I've done it correctly. Now there's only one more thing you have to do. If you want to play with your friends, you want to jump onto multiplayer. There are hundreds of servers that you guys could play on, but personally, my favorite server has to be Pixelmon Realms. So enter into the server name Pixelmon Realms. And then on the server address, you want to enter pt.pixelmonrealms.com. Once you've done that, you just got to click done. And eventually, once the server has been searched for, it'll come up down at the bottom here with Pixelmon Realms. Now that you're finally into the server, if you guys want to join me on my current adventure, you want to head over to the Scarlet server. Once you right click on the Scarlet character, you'll be loaded into the Scarlet server. For me, I currently have just started my journey and I'm starting with a custom textured Charmeleon. It's super cool and there's so many different custom textures on the server. I'm doing a special type of video on this one, so if you join me soon, you may be able to feature in the video if you see me around. But I would definitely come and join the server as there's so much to do and it's just getting started on the 1.16.5 new update. So, if you do end up joining, I really hope to see you guys around on the server. And without further ado guys, I really hope this was helpful for you guys and was able to help you install Pixelmon onto Minecraft so you guys can play and have as much fun as I am playing with all of your friends. So without further ado, I will see you guys in the next video very soon.